My name is Luis Cortez. I'm 29 years old, and I work for City of Hialeah Fire Rescue. For all of our heroes, you know, most of them get a second career, and Lou's no exception. Laser Lou, bro, Laser Lou. Back to back Gold Cup champion. If you can get your name on that trophy, you've made it. It's fun being on the pointy end sometimes, huh? It's awesome. You should pull me more often. Oh yeah? You keep winning the Gold Cup, I'll treat you a day every year. Come on back to Mr. Raskob here, buddy. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> nice, dude. Nice, Thank you, buddy. Man. That was awesome. Keep going slow. Here he comes. Keep going, keep going slow. Keep going. Got him. Pull. Let him go. Nasty. Nasty, buddy. Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him, baby. Get tight. Up tight, baby. Up tight. It's all 90 pounders. 90 pounders? Oh, oh, oh. Big fish, too. It's a big one. Oh, baby. Come on. It's a big one. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, man. Oh, no. Jenna, no, you gotta only use medical. It's all the way over here. Yep, yep. Oh, oh yeah, baby! I got him. Look, look oh at my god, Greyhound! Oh! <laughs> Good game. That's game, baby. Luis Cortez has been one of my best friends for, God, you know, 15 years. <laughs> God, the cheating over there. When he gets into something, he is as intense and dedicated to it. He gets, and he gets into a bunch of things, let me tell you, a bunch of things. I'm 29 years old, and I work for City of Hialeah Fire Rescue. Uh, basically, I'm the driver of the truck and I'm, I'm responsible for everything that, that is involved with the truck. Uh, I enjoy being a fireman because every day is not the same. There are days where we do make a difference. We get to help people in various ways. As a firefighter, our schedule works out that we work 24 hours on and 48 hours off. And a lot of us uh, choose to to have other jobs because of our time, and I chose to be a fishing guide uh, in the Florida Keys. Just like teachers and police officers and firefighters, you know, we, I wish that I, they get paid 10 times for everything they do. But the reality, you know, for all of our heroes, they have a hard time raising a family on that salary and that salary alone. And, you know, most of them get a second career, and lose no exception. Laser Lou, bro, Laser Lou. Back to back Gold Cup champion. I'm pumped that you've been winning these back to back, but I'm over it. You gotta give someone else a turn, bro. It's it's really it's really just a special accomplishment to do it yeah. twice in a row. For sure, you know, just I mean, doing it one time, you know. I just want to get out here, go have some fun, and treat you to a day of pulling around. You're gonna pull me all day, man. All day, like all day. It. I like my it. My treat. The half day rate, though, you okay. know. Half I got day you. rate. I got you. you. Got me. Cause I know you got a little bit of that money. <laughs> I got they got a little bit of that money. There's one tournament that is the cream of the crop, it is a Super Bowl, it is a Stanley Cup, it is the real deal. And that's the Gold Cup. If you can get your name on that trophy, you've made it. You've made it. And you are 1,000% into a club forever that will be a legend. Fishing tournaments, it's always something I did before I was a guide um, and once I became a guide and I kind of got the taste of it, of not being the angler on the bow, it brought a different level to the game. And to me, it's more rewarding winning as a, as a guide or a captain and guiding that person to the fish.
Look at the size of that fish. This is a beast, dude. Beast mode. Fish the legend. At Bonefish and Tarpon Trust, we're working to make sure that you'll find healthy populations of bonefish, tarpon, and permit at your favorite destinations. From the Florida Keys to Belize, from the Bahamas to Mexico. But we need your help to fight for clean water and healthy habitats. After all, if we don't conserve our flats fisheries, who will? Please support us today at btt.org and help us bring science to the fight. Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Maverick Boats, Fish the Legend. Yamaha, reliability starts here. Costa, see what's out there. And by Bonefish and Tarpon Trust, bringing science to the fight. And now, 60 seconds in the mill house. Um, <coughs> Jeff, it is such a pleasure to be with you in your home. I'm completely honored. I've seen you on the, on the docks here and there. I've seen what you've done over the years and people have spoken about you. You know, your uh, Jose's last show obviously was with you. What was that last day of fishing like with him? Which was a very unfortunate thing. And the other question I have with you, were you, how long were you haunted or if you're still haunted by the fact that the end of that day that you guys fished, he ended up uh, passing with a terrible plane crash at the airport. I'd give up everything to have him back. Yeah. I'd give up my guiding career, you know. Yeah, for sure. I don't know, <laughs> you know, it's, you're still haunted by yeah. it. Yeah. I, I still hear him laughing in the trees. You know, I, I, I pull into spots. And, like, we would debate things all the time. Like what? We were throwing spinning rods. We were throwing this, you know, the uh, the zoom lures, the, you know, the soft plastic jerk baits. And, he, you know, I'm on the back of the boat. I rig it up for him. Pulls up. He looks at like this. You did it backwards. I said, no. That's how I do it. That's the right way. Well, if you look at the package, they say you got to go through this way. The hook comes up and you skin hook it. I'm like, yeah, but now your hook point's exposed and now you're going to get caught in the trees. <laughs> okay. Flicks a cast right in there, twitch, 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 gets snagged in the tree. <laughs> and you know Jose, you know, he, he just kind of stands on the front boat. You see the shoulders drop. You just turn around that, that giggle. Is, right, you right, know? right. To watch this and other full-length episodes of the Millhouse podcast, go to YouTube or wherever you find your podcasts. My job as, as a fishing guide here in the Florida Keys, and it's a ton of fun. The people I get to fish with, the people I get to share the, the, the day with on the water, I mean, they're a ton of fun. And, uh, you know, the Keys is always a phenomenal area to fish, but, you know, the one thing that I tend to see more and more of is all these different boats that are coming in with immigrants either from Haiti or Cuba. You could just, you could tell how many people were on there. Look at all the different clothing and shoes. And I think they said this one had 160 people on. This one did? This one. I see it when I watch the news on Texas coast and the borders of there of, of people coming in from Mexico, but you know, people don't realize of what happens here in the Keys, you know, and how many people actually you know, reach the USA from our 100 mile stretch. Right here, right here, nine o'clock, 20 feet, drop it. Get him, got him. Nice, dude, nice. <laughs> Stay on you little guy. <laughs> You're on your feet there. Good bite though. I believe I can fly. Superstar. 
good bite. I like that. This would be a strapper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> He's at least. Look at this other one right here. 72 inches. What's that? You got more? Get him, Jay. Get him, Jay. Get him, Jay. Get him, Jay. Oh. Oh. Oh, got weed all over it. I got some more here, Lou. Can you stake it? Yeah, keep it. Is it too hard? I'm gonna take advantage huh? of myself. Keep, keep fighting here, get yours off, but. Pretty little guy, look at that. I got the guy, the Gold Cup champ to the tarpon. Thank you, buddy. We're gonna get, find some bigger ones, though. Yeah. And it's good to find with these little ones. I love Craig Brewer telling me that. Grab it here, let go of his mouth. Pinch it. He does that every time. Thanks, Steve. Every time. Catch another Thanks, one. sir. Catch another one. I'm like a little kid up here, man. Get an extra pair of eyes you can depend on with our most powerful radar yet. Get more power for vastly improved range and higher resolution. Get more fish. Halo 3000 debuts Bird Plus mode. Get more safety with smart new features like Zone Track and Velocity Track. And get more simplicity. With a range of preset modes, Halo radars have never been so easy to use. Halo Open Array from Simrad, our most powerful radar yet. Your time on the water is precious. You return season after season to make unforgettable memories, fight a few fish, reconnect with friends, and recenter yourself. If you count on having this time, you need an outboard you can count on to power it. That's why boaters stay with Yamaha for the long run, for life. They know reliability starts here. Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Shimano Fishing Products and G. Loomis Rods. Feel connected. Simred Chart Plotters. Go with confidence. Florida Marine Tracks. Clarity in navigation. And by Pathfinder Boats. Angler Driven. Move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Slow down. Bump, bump, bump. Bump, 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 got him. Underneath, go low, go low, go low. Yep. Is it around the prop? Oh, it's clear. It's under the motor. Come back here if you need to. Is it gone? Nope, he's still there. Gone. Oh, dude. Gone. <laughs> that was fun. That was fun. I just saw a bust inside. Where? It, way inside, like right by the trees. Definite bust though. Man, the other one with them was like 40 pounds. A little excitement there. Yeah, that was fun. You gotta love the chaos. Go right down the middle, just a leader. Bump, 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 slow. A little far there, bro. The other one's coming back to the right. Close to the right. Don't see him. Go to your left, about 20. Okay, I got him now. Light ticks. No, I didn't like it. Slow. Go. Stop. Strip fast, strip long. Strip. Strip slow, strip, 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 go. Strip. Oh. He's still, he's still there. He's coming right here. Keep going, keep going. He's coming right by the boat to the left. Yep. Nicer fish, bro. Nice, blue. Nice, bro. Watch your line there. Watch your line. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. good. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that thing's awesome, gonna circle. Nice, Lou. Woo! Woo! Dude, they, that thing did a 360. I didn't even see the bite. Huh? <laughs> I didn't see the bite. Dude, he turned all set, he turned all the way around and boom, head out of the water. Oh. Give it a little more juice, Jay. Yeah. You go right a little bit. Okay. I think he's around one of those fans. Oh, is he? Yeah. Okay. It's gonna be a fun fish on a nine weight. Very fun fish. Nice, bud. All right, stop. 
There he is. Nice and easy, baby. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's gonna do it. It's fun to watch somebody knows what they're doing, especially a buddy too, though. You think so? Huh? I screwed up quite a bit today. Oh, uh, you know what? That's okay. <laughs> so have I. It makes, it makes uh, you know, all that struggling, the reward, something like this. That much you know, better. 40 pounder on a nine weight. We got the leader, buddy. That's a nice fish, man. For a nine weight? For a nine weight? Great fish. We'll take it. He'd be a release. Uh, he's close. Huh? He's close. Close. I think he would. I think he would be close to it. You know, usually a fish like this is going. Berserk, yeah, jumping like crazy. Right? Yeah. No, he. I don't think he's jumped once. Come up! Come up! Oh, come up! Come oh, up! Come up! Oh, come up! Okay. Come okay. up. Okay. He's gonna jump. He's gonna jump. Come on, baby. Nice. Oh, these things are so fun. <laughs> yeah, it's been a little, it's been blowing today. This is that part we always talking about, you know, when you're in a tournament, the nerve wracking as oh, yeah. a guide, right? Yep. I mean, all you can do is position the bow in the All you can do way, is drive it, yep. But the whole time, you know, you're just thinking about the worst <laughs> case situation, and that's obviously him jumping off, wearing through. This is the place in a tournament where you hyperventilate. For sure. Not a jumper, huh? It's kind of hooked on the outside, left side. Oh, that's an awesome fish on a nine weight, dude. Coming up a little higher. <laughs> Lou, nice, buddy. <laughs> oh, awesome, nice. dude. Awesome, man. Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Free Fly Apparel. Comfort on, adventure out. Mako Reels, built to last, built to stop. By Yeti, built for the wild. And by Ameritrail Trailers, load, launch, relax. Yeah, that's right, three, two. Woo! All day, that's all day. Shasha. And now, a minute from our conservation partner, Bonefish and Tarpon Trust. Restoration of Florida's Everglades is critical for the state's iconic fisheries, habitat, and water quality. Historically, water from the Kissimmee River flowed to Lake Okeechobee, which once full would overflow its southern bank, allowing clean, fresh water to make its way to Florida Bay in a shallow sheet. But over a century of changes to this system to accommodate development and agriculture currently prevent it from working like it's supposed to. As a result, in recent years, we've seen devastating algal blooms affect both the east and west coast of the state and the lake itself, while salinity fluctuations have resulted in large-scale seagrass die-offs in Florida Bay. And there's a connection to coral disease and red tide. However, the word of the day is momentum. We are seeing progress being made, planning, funding, constructing, and completing Everglades restoration projects. We've had historic funding levels and historic cooperation between state and federal government that are allowing restoration work to move more quickly. 
construction is complete on the restoration of the Kissimmee River and C-44 reservoirs, and by 2025, we'll have the C-43 reservoir finished and southerly water flows restored under the Tamiami Trail. Meanwhile, construction is underway in the critical central portion of the Everglades where the EAA reservoir is located. And we've got planning almost complete on storage north of the lake. All this to say, we're seeing unprecedented progress and cooperation that coupled with lots of funding have us poised to see positive changes for Florida's fisheries and environment in the near future. To learn more, visit btt.org. He's very close. Huh? Very close, I think. Could That's go either thing, way. Man. You gotta fight him no matter what. Yeah. Me and Jared, we used to fish a lot when we were younger. I used to come down and stay at his parents' house and we used to just go out and fun fish all the time. And you know, over the years, we've both gotten busy with our careers and we just don't get the chance to do it as often. And when we do now, it's, um, it's just always a lot of fun to get out there with him. It's fun being on the pointy end sometimes, huh? It's awesome. You should pull me more often. Oh yeah? <laughs> you keep winning the Gold Cup, I'll treat you a day every year. One day, huh? One day. How about okay. a week? A week? No. You win the Gold Cup three times in a row, I'll agree to a week. Come on back to Mr. Raskov well, here, almost. buddy. Almost. Hey, how you doing? Oh, I thought she was going to give me in the mouth. thought she was going to give me the mouth. Nah, she don't like you. I don't blame her. She, I think I tickled her with the hair on my hands. <laughs> right? It came in. There's contact with the skin. Yeah. There's an inch of hair wiggling in there. I think she got a little of that. It tickled her on her lip there, and she's like, not today. Nice and easy, baby. Nice and easy, baby. Nice, come on. Come on in and dance with us. Nothing cooler than going and watching your boy pull on a fish. Back like the good old days. I mean, God, we used to fish a lot. And then life got real. I love the color, the green that they oh, get in that off color water there. Yeah. Real turquoise. Almost there? Yep. Okay. Get. <laughs> Lou. Nice, buddy. <laughs> oh, awesome, nice. Dude. Awesome, man. Oh, 40 pounder. Yeah. So? Yeah. Nice, dude. Nice, Thank you, buddy. Man. That was awesome. Uh, that was fun, dude. Soaked. I'll tell you what, man. It's been a grind trying to pick away this late in the season. It has, and, been, uh, for sure. We had some smaller fish, saw a few decent ones like that, and had some misses. But all in all, it's been fun, man. It's been awesome, you know, dude. We, I appreciate you getting me back out here, man. Oh, you kidding? It's been a while. Me? I wish we had more time to do it, but you know, I think it's uh, that was a great fish to end. You know, head back to the house, man. I think the girls and all the kids are going to be playing around and get back to them. We had a good little sneak away and let's do it. Enjoy it. Man. Thank you, buddy. Enjoy it. Next time, you're pulling me. I'm pulling you. You're pulling me. You're pulling me, baby. Woo! Way to go. Go, Cup Jeff. Two times. Two times. Comes. Oh.